Hey, Mike with Nerd Problems Gaming here. In today's video, we'll be doing an unboxing of a refurbished Steam Deck from Valve and the Steam Dock. So let's get into it. So again, decided to pick up a Steam Deck and wanted to try it out first, kind of the refurbished model. Uh, this one is the LCD uh, 256 gigabyte model. And so with this one, again, kind of wanted to get that refurbished one. I don't do a ton on Steam currently, but I'm definitely really intrigued. I am a big fan of the Switch and having the ability to play on the go as well as docked. And so I figured I could do kind of the same type of thing, um, but with Steam. And just wanted to kind of try it out first before I really dove in and got a whole OLED model and everything. So again, this is the LCD version of the deck. Now again, comes with this cool carrying case. Uh, it does look like it's sealed tight. So I'm gonna have to, I guess, break that seal here um, to get inside. So let's do that. And I wasn't sure, I've heard good things that refurbish can definitely be the way to go. I think it still has like a year warranty um, and everything there. But first let's actually dive in here. I think this is maybe just uh, the power supply, but let's dig in and see. Yeah, so let's see what we get in here. It's like the power supply, power brick, and then maybe a little instruction manual for the deck itself. Upside down maybe. There you go, cool. But yeah, let's dig into the system itself. I guess it opens like this. And let's check out the system. So I don't really see any red flags, I guess. Everything looks like it's in good shape. I mean, it feels brand new. I don't think I could tell that this is uh, refurbished. A little just dust specks on there, but no issues. Um, see if this turns on, perhaps. Maybe I need to hold it down. And I don't also know if this needs to be charged before you can use it. Kind of looks like that must be the case, but buttons feel good. Like I said, I would not be able to tell that this is not a brand new system. So that's pretty cool. Again, I'll have to charge it to find out uh, everything works okay, but we've got the dock as well. Again, kind of wanted to have that switch experience where I could play docked, set it up on my TV if I wanted to, maybe other computer monitors go directly to that. Having that flexibility of the deck, but I just got the basic uh, Steam version of their dock. I know there's a ton of different docks out there. So if there's other versions I should be getting, definitely let me know in the comments. I did see a bunch, but heard some people had kind of compatibility issues with other docks, potentially not syncing right, whatever the case might be. So I decided to just go with the Valve brand here. But again, pretty simple. It's got the USB C port here on the top. Go right in the Steam to charge. Um, HDMI, Ethernet, charging port, several USBs. But again, seems legit. I'll have to try it out. And then looks like I've also got um, another charger here at the dock. I'm sure it's for the dock, but looks like I could maybe use it for the deck itself as well. So really excited to check this out, kind of dip my toe into the PC gaming world, kind of a new realm for me. I've always just done uh, console gaming up to this point, but I've been told that the Steam Deck is pretty much like a console experience, but just uh, you get to use PC games. So excited to check it out. But again, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button as it really helps out the channel. And let me know in the comments, are there any great accessories I should be getting now that I have a Steam Deck? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. 
If there's other great games I should check out on Steam, I know there's a kind of a bigger library compared to maybe console games, some games I might have missed out on now that I'm really dipping my toe into the PC gaming world. So if there's some great ones I should check out, let me know that as well. But again, stay tuned for a future video when we do a review on the Steam Deck once we've had some time to use it. And if you'd like to help support the channel, pick out content and more, consider becoming a patron of ours over at nerdproblemsgaming.com forward slash Patreon. And another really cool way you can help support the channel is we actually partnered with a game store, Nutmeg Games. So if you like magic cards, board games, Pokemon cards, Yu-Gi-Oh cards, and more, be sure to head to nutmeggames.com forward slash nerdproblemsgaming or use our promo code nerdproblemsgaming at checkout. You can actually get 10% off your order and help support our channel at the same time. So again, if you did want to take advantage of that great discount, be sure to head there as well. And if you like videos like this on video games, board games, and everything nerdy, check out one of our other videos here. And if you haven't done so yet, be sure to subscribe and turn on the bell notifications to get the latest updates of new nerd videos we put out. But once again, thanks for tuning in, and we'll talk to you more soon.